Well, good morning, everybody. <coughs> good morning, good morning. Pink skies. Well, good morning, everybody. I'm going to give you the star report of the day. Are you ready? As I'm doing this, I'm hoping it records properly. Sky watchers set for Dragonoid or Dragonoid, Dragonoid media shower. I think that's how you say it. Anyways, October is set to be a bumper month for spotting shooting stars in the sky. The Dragonoid media shower is set to reach its peak on Wednesday evening. It's estimated that around five shooting stars should be visible overhead every hour. The event will be visible in the UK skies. Media showers are usually associated with comets as these balls of ice dust orbit the sun. It releases clouds of dust and ice. So keep an eye open for that, guys. The media showers, <laughs> my dog's freaking out, or shooting stars can be seen with the earth passes through the streams of tiny debris, causing streaks of light. If you miss the dragnoids, there is a chance to see other media showers later in the month. Now keep this in mind. How to see it, everybody knows a little big dicker, what we call the little or the big dipper. Just look in that area, right? I don't give you nothing else. Or the dragonoid radiant. It's like, where, you know, it looks like a shopping cart. It's a big dipper. Okay, that's what I call it. <clears throat> On the right is the Dracon. And it's right about the Virgo area, you know, that side of the sky. So keep an eye open for that. And so what are the, the dragonoids, right? You ask, what are these things? Oh, ready? The shooting stars is named after Drago, the dragon constellation. That's why I'm talking about it, because I want to reveal the dragon. They are generated as the Earth passes through the debris from the Gibgabian center comet, whatever. How to see the Dragonoid media shower? The Dragonoids are expected to be the most spectacular the 6th, 7th, and 7th, 8th of October. So the 6th to the 7th and 7th and 8th. Okay, now, not like many other media showers this one you can watch as the sun goes down okay so keep that in mind you gotta get out there early tonight and tomorrow night while most other media showers are best seen in the early hours the dragonoids are best seen in the evening hours after nightfall okay so about five an hour find a place with a good clear view of the stars ideally in an area with little light pollution go up on the hill what are the treats are in store for the stargazers. Okay, October the 20th and 21st, you got the um, another system. The Orion, say that one. Orionoid, Orionid, Orionoids meteor shower. I guess that's how you say it. Anyway, in November you got one. October the 10th, 9th and 10th, you got a constellation of Tarsus meteor shower. So there's like four of them in a month. All right, guys, that was the report, and a little different. Talk to you later. Oh, it didn't keep going, so that report was a waste.